And Sarah, this is the moment many families have been waiting for. This trial has been going on for well over five weeks, and we were watching on a monitor from another room, and it's clear many of these families have become very emotional during this trial, and especially during this verdict. Now, Alex Jones was not here when that verdict was reached. The times that he was here, he bashed the legitimacy of the court, calling it a show trial and kangaroo court. Each of the plaintiffs testified about the impact Jones' lies had on their families, marking it a very emotional moment for everyone. Now, some say they received threatening letters and were confronted in public by people who believed the Sandy Hook shooting was a hoax. Jones' defense attorney, Norm Pattis, argued free speech and said there was no proof of these letters or them being threatened in general. Now, the jury has been very thorough throughout their deliberations, requesting a copy of the jury charge and to see a piece of the evidence. The judge complimented the jury, saying this is an example of them taking this decision seriously. Now, some may be wondering, so is this trial over? Well, technically, yes, for compensatory damages, but they still have to figure out punitive damages, which is attorney's fees and cost at a later date. I'm live in Waterbury, Carmen Chow, Fox 61 News.